In this tutorial, we will learn about sharpening an image. The objective of this technique is to ensure that the object is pin sharp. The tools we'll be using are Smart Objects and Smart Sharpen Filter. To start, ensure that you select the background layer. We need to convert this layer to a Smart Object. To do this, right mouse click and convert to Smart Object. This will enable us to use re-editable filters, but we can no longer edit the photo itself directly. So ensure that you have done any direct editing of the photo prior to doing this step. Now that we've done this, we go up to the filter menu, go down to the sharpen option and choose smart sharpen. This is the smart sharpen dialog box. This part of the dialog box shows a 100% magnification of the image. We can choose where it magnifies by moving and clicking on the image as such. These are the settings that we'll be using to set our sharpening. Generally speaking, unless your image is actually out of focus, the default setting of 100% and 1 pixel is acceptable. You have to be very cautious with sharpening. If you sharpen too far on the radius, you get a wonderful halo effect around the outside of your buildings. If you sharpen too far on the amount, you get a grainy effect right across the image. So keeping it set at 100% and 1 pixel is a good start. It may not seem like much, but again, using the preview, we can see there is a significant difference. Once you have done that, click OK, and you see underneath the image, we now have the smart filters. If you want to change the settings in the smart filter any time, just merely have to double click and it brings the dialog box back up.